tell everybody how you're feeling. I'm doing great. Uh, you know, a lot better than I look. Just kind of hobbling around on crutches, but then people say, what's wrong with him, you know? What's he got? Bob Lobel lives with spinal stenosis and lives with plenty of pain. I do have a lot of pain in the bottom of my feet, peripheral neuropathy. And because of that, the man who was one of the most popular faces of local sports in Boston is now becoming the face of medical marijuana in Massachusetts. It's eliminated the pain, Marie. It's it's taken it down. The painful road of medical problems led Bob here. After two knee replacements, he was taking oxycodone, and he realized that was becoming a slippery slope. So when medical marijuana became available, Bob was in. But he also makes it very clear there's a huge difference between medicinal and recreational. This is what he would tell his kids. I can simply say to my kids, just check it out. You know, you're going to do what you're going to do. All I care about is you being safe, and you can't do anything stupid. Taking an edible and eating it is stupid without knowing what's in it. People are going to offer you stuff that you never thought was doable. But don't be stupid and just take it because you think it's cool. Just, just be careful. And Bob is now back in the spotlight with a podcast called Bob Lobel's New England Podcast. <laughs> you're Bob Lobel, and you're known everywhere, and now you're becoming Bob Lobel the medical marijuana guy. I don't want to be the Pied Piper of pot. I don't want to be that guy, you know. I don't want to be, you know, leveled or, or in that playing field where it feels dirty or it feels like wrong. I want to still be everything you said I was before, but I'm just doing the best I can for the pain that I have, and I also know it's the kind of similar pain that a lot of people have. And if it works for me, it'll work for them. Bob is soon going to take the first episode of his mm -hmm. podcast mm -hmm. and plans on launching it publicly this summer.